The San Francisco 49ers ran for 30 touchdowns in 2019, counting the postseason, and no team, including the Ravens, were close. Let's take a look at some of the magic dust that the 49ers play with. Their run game coordinator is Mike McDaniels. These motions and movements, like Kittle going over from one side to the other, with man coverage, Dre Kirkpatrick, 27 going with him. This is an influence block right here by Kittle. He sets up the end, influence block to set up the guard coming to trap him. Now, here comes use check on the wind back, cleaning up Nate or Nick Vigil right there. And remember, Jeffrey Wilson scored four touchdowns the first two weeks of the season. Now, watch this play against the Steelers. All right? You're going to get Debo's going to come, number 19, Debo Samuels, coming in motion here. Now, right here, this fake by Debo, watch what it does to T.J. Watt, number 90, to the right. All right? T.J. doesn't know right here who has the ball. So watch what he does. He widens. All right? He goes out. Joe Hayden goes out. Here comes the trap, all right? Inside trap by Tomlinson. Here comes Juszczyk to clean up, and Wilson goes for a touchdown. Now, that was from one yard out. They come back and double up the exact same play. Remember what the Steelers did, the first one. Watch T.J. Watt, okay? Watch Edmonds right here, 34. Watch what they do when Debo comes this time. Here he comes. But the Steelers are smart now. They've seen it once, so now they don't overreact. They actually play it right. But this time, the 49ers just flat out block it great. Kittle with a great block, check with the cut block, and Wilson finishes in the paint for the second touchdown by him in this game. It's the exact same play. Okay, now, let's watch this. Watch the fullback motion. Watch what it does to the linebackers here. Watch how the linebackers flow. When use check goes in motion here. All right, here we go. They slide. Now, this is the back. It's going to go back to the left, but they want to move the linebackers. So, when use check goes to the weak side here, in this motion, the linebackers step with them. And that gives all the linemen an angle on the linebacker. They all get trapped inside. Look at them. Now, here comes use check on the back side. Here comes Kittle. And there goes Brita. For 83 yards. 83 yards to pay dirt. Okay? Just by moving the linebackers with the movement. Now, the movements and the motions and the influences are game specific. Each week it's different. All right? Let's watch this here. All right? Here we go. Kittle is out wide. Look at him. Kittle's out wide. And it's drawing all kinds of attention here. All right? Here we go. All right, now, you've got Coleman here. He's going to go to the right side of Garoppolo. All right? Cleveland adjusts. Here we go. Now, watch the attention to detail here. This is a the gut. They're going to pull the center and the left guard. Excellent down blocks right here, all right, by the tackle and the tight end. Kick out. Now, watch. But even... Watch Garoppolo's fake here, and watch what it does to the front side in case they want to come back to the smash route concept up at the top. Now, watch how they cut this defense in half, how perfect the footwork, the timing, everything down right there. Look at how they cut this defense off in half. Look at the alley. And Tevin Coleman goes 19 yards to pay dirt. All right, here we go. Now, on this play here against Carolina, watch the left guard, Lakin Tomlinson. Nobody's going to block the defensive tackle over him, Gerald McCoy. Now, here we go. We got a motion here by Dante Pettis. All right? Pettis goes in motion. Goes to motion behind the quarterback. Now, they're going to option McCoy because they want to block Coot Keekley inside with the guard. The, the option here holds the tackle. All right, now a couple things. Look at the secondary. They're in cover two. Two deep safeties. All right, so now the, the fake right here holds the safeties and the whole secondary. Nobody knows. Now, give it to Coleman. Remember the secondary, how they were frozen? All right, that allows him to finish. Now, here is the same play. Here we go. 
All right, here goes Pettis in the ghost motion. Watch the defensive tackle here, unblocked. All right, the option holds him. All right, now, the guard that can block the tackle blocks down on Keekly. The option holds McCoy. Now, here we go. One cut here by Coleman, and with his speed, touchdown. Here we go. Now, on this play here, Debo's going to go in motion to a bunch formation. Here we go. All right, you got Debo, you got Sanders, everybody in a bunch. Carolina just. All right, now, Sanders is going to go back. Sanders goes back, Carolina just. Now, right here, he, Sanders kind of fakes like he's got it, so it widens the end, which sets up the guards block, Lincoln Tomlinson on the end. Now, the underneath handoff to Debo, and they don't block Luke Keekley on the play. It's a consistent theme, a consistent theme. In fact, let's watch it from the end zone. Here we go. Now, here comes the motion. All right. There goes the motion. Look at Keekley, 59. Shaq Thompson, 54. Eric Davis, 25. Now, just watch on this play. Nothing but Keekley. He does not get blocked on the play. The motion, the movement, the window dressing. Watch him. See that? He looks back for one second. He should make the play. But his eyes are taken off. He's taking the cheese with all the motion and movement. He freezes right there, and Debo runs right by him. And watch the frustration by Keekley. He knows it. He took the cheese, and he's like, he can't believe it. He could have, if he doesn't take the cheese, maybe he makes the tackle. All right, now, two separate motions here. Two separate motions. Here we go. Watch what it does to Carolina. Here goes one motion. Now. Here comes a tight end dragging. Watch this. Tight end drags behind him. Now, let's keep an eye on Eric Davis, 25, Brian Burns, 53, Shaq Thompson, 54. Right here, Nick Mullins is going to hand the ball off to Mostert. Okay, here we go. Now watch, 54, 53, 25 are out of the picture. Right here, Keekley gets picked off, and look at that hole open. One thing we found out about Mostert, he's got great speed. We knew that at Purdue when he was a track champion at Purdue. And now he's getting big, huge lanes to run through. All right, here we go. On this play here, down at the bottom is Sanders. He has to go outside because it's man coverage. So he's going to take the corner with him. Now, watch how this alley opens up, how fast it opens up. Watch Kittle block Dante Fowler here at the bottom. Bam. All right, he blocks Fowler. Now, here we go. Run the pattern. Everybody's blocked here at the second level. Remember the outside release by Sanders? He takes the corner off. Most of just runs in the alley. Like if it was flag football, nobody would have ripped the flag off of Raheem Mostert. All right, now we said that it's a consistent theme that they don't block the middle linebacker on big plays. Here comes Kyle Juszczyk into motion. Number 44. Watch the middle linebacker, Bobby Wagner. He's probably led Seattle in tackles eight straight years in a row. He's a great player, but he's a pattern reader like all middle linebackers. Now, his partner in crime is K.J. Wright, number 50. They're talking right here. Now, watch the motion and the movement of the left guard and use check here. It looks like counter tray to the weak side. Here it is, counter. Look at the steps by the back. It's a counter step. Watch the linebackers play the counter. Okay? It's a counter, except it's a reverse. Okay, so let's take a look. Here it is. All right, now, watch Wagner, 54 in your picture. Here comes Juice Check. Watch him and KJ Wright. They're both in communication. Watch it go left. Watch it go left. That's what KJ's saying. There goes the guard. There goes the guard, Tomlinson. There goes the fullback. There goes Wagner. Now you flip it to Debo. Let's watch the whole play from the wide. Here it is. Here comes the guard. Now Juszczyk reverses his field. Watch the motion. Now they pick up a free blocker. Now let's watch the downfield blocks, okay? It's bowling for dollars. Number 63 on Delano Hill. Bam. Here comes Juszczyk. Two for one. 
right? He gets both pins down, KJ and Shaq. And all Debo has to do is spin into the paint for the touchdown. Let's watch the same play. Here it is. All the way through. Watch Wagner and right here. Wagner's playing. He's playing the, the counter tray. Here comes the reverse. They've just taken care of the leading tackler for Seattle. The downfield blocks, superb. Throw the blade, get the guys on the ground. Bam. All right. Now, let's watch this play here. Watch Kittle. Kittle's going to absolute. he's going to block three. So he's got man mo in motion right here. All right, man coverage. Now he's going back. This, now he's going back like he's running a flat route to the end zone. And he takes the safety, the linebacker, and everybody with him. Now Seattle's all out of their gap. Watch, the safety and the linebacker are in the same gap here. And Juszczyk is just going to take them both. Most of goes for a touchdown. All right, now, here we go. Watch this here. Watch Debo go in motion from a three-by-one set. All right, now, Kevin King, number 20, is on Debo. So what does he do? He's like, ah, I'll just tell my safety, Darnell Savage, you go. Let's rotate. You rotate down. I'll take your play, your place. Replacement. Now, right here, the fake holds Kevin King, number 20. All right, now watch what happens. Remember that safety is supposed to be down there? With Debo, he's not there. So Debo's going to block him. All he's got to do right here, Moster, is outrun Blake Martinez. Here it is. There's Martinez, number 50. All right? Now here goes Debo in motion. Kevin King goes with him. All right, now it's a check with me. All right, he saw a man coverage. So now he's got the second play in. Now they know the play. Here we go. Watch the fake. The fake is key. Look at Martinez. He's, he's playing run all the way. Look at the double team. They've now just blocked Martinez in the down man. All right, remember Savage? Watch him. Look at this. Kittle right here. They're in man coverage here on, on Kittle. Watch Savage. Savage 26 has Kittle. They blocked Tremont Williams 38, Zadaria Smith, and Savage with just... Motion and movement, knowing what they're going to get, man coverage. They're not even looking at Moster. All right, here we go. New Orleans. Remember that play where they don't block the middle linebacker against Seattle and against Carolina? Here's the exact same play, except Kittle is in the place of Juszczyk. Demario Davis, the leading tackler for New Orleans last two years, doesn't get blocked on this play. Now, Kittle throws the blade. Down goes P.J. Williams. All right, down goes Lattimore. The blades are coming out. Debo goes for that. Let's watch the play here. Now watch, watch DeMario Davis here, 56. All right, here we go. Here comes the weak side counter tray. The trapper and the rapper. They're coming right at Cam Jordan, 94. Watch DeMario overplay it. Pattern read. Here it is. Except now they pick up a blocker on that movement by Kittle. Kittle throws the blade. Down goes one. Garland throws the blade on Lattimore. Down goes two. And if Stanley could get on the horse, if Debo sets him up, he'd take Marcus Williams, and maybe Debo goes to the house. All right, let's watch this play against Atlanta. Tevin Coleman. Wing T formation. Man coverage on Pettis, right? Pettis goes in motion. Kendall Fuller runs with him. They're in a twin set. Twins will reveal whether a team is in man or zone. When the corner goes over with them, corner's over, man coverage. All right, now, here goes Sanders back. All right, now, Sheffield is late, number 20. Watch him. He's out of, the, out of the picture. Ricardo Allen, number 37, is covering for him in case they throw it right here to Sanders, which they don't. Now, there they go. Tevin Coleman goes for 37 yards. Do you realize that Atlanta had 362 rushes in 2019 and not one run went for 37 yards? Not one. San Francisco does it, and they don't block Deion Jones, number 45, the middle linebacker. This is how they do it. Here's the same play. Here goes Sanders in motion. All right. The play action right here. Watch this. Watch what this, just that motion right there does to Deion Jones, number 45. Watch him freeze. Watch where his eyes are. It fools the cameraman, too. And there goes Coleman against his old team for 37 yards. Casey saves the touchdown. And then 
This is the third play of the Super Bowl. The third play of the Super Bowl, all right, Kittle comes in motion. Here we go. This play looks like it's power O to the left. Kittle block down. Juszczyk's going to cut to no passing zone. The right guard's going to pull. It's nothing more than power. Look at the safeties back 12 yards deep. All right, they don't know who has the ball right here. They're playing safe. They're safeties. Here comes the flip to Debo. And Debo goes for 32. There's throw in the open spaces. This is the genius of Mike McDaniels of the San Francisco 49ers. The run game coordinator. By design. He's been with Kyle Shanahan in Washington, Cleveland, Atlanta, and now San Francisco. And might be the smartest guy on the staff the way that they design these plays. It's a pleasure to watch, and I'm glad I could show you a few of the tricks and the design that Mike McDaniels puts in, game-specific, week to week.